we all ask questions. Questions are a basic and necessary part of everyday life. How else would we know what other people expect from us? But the questions we ask don't always lead to the answers that will help us to be more effective with our work. How do we know what questions to ask? It might sound like a simple task, but really focusing on what you're asking a person can help you to better understand the issues at hand. In complicated situations, there is never one right answer or approach. Laddering is a technique that can help you to improve your understanding about what is relevant, what is important and what is not. This simple framework prompts you to start asking questions in different ways and to start combining these questions to reach more revealing answers. The question ladder shows how to combine a range of who, what, where, when, why and how questions, coupled with words like is, did, can, will, would and might. Nikita works at an IT for development company. One of their projects is to produce and share videos of good farming methods across rural parts of India. The company uses an internally developed technology for their video management. The system is not very user friendly and requires a lot of time and effort from Nikita and her colleagues. It needs to be updated. But how? Nikita decides to ask all the people who use the management system to assess how they use it. Understanding their thoughts on uploading videos and mapping them will give her and her team a better idea of how to make the system better. She doesn't want to waste anyone's time with a questionnaire that might lead to nothing. She decides to use the question ladder tool to construct some very specific questions as a warm-up before moving on to more open-ended questions. She begins with more simple questions. Something as simple as who is and why is. She then develops more complex questions by working across the worksheet such as where did, who can, and what will. The would and might columns can help to construct questions that will lead to more revealing answers. How would, who might. Nikita now has a good set of questions for her survey. She is confident that what they are asking will trigger useful answers. Answers that will indicate what needs to be changed in their system and how. The question ladder helped Nikita organise her thoughts to come up with a questionnaire designed to get to the heart of the issue. It can be used in different situations to explore issues in different directions. And once you have experience with using this approach, you might find yourself automatically using it in your own conversations.